Hey everyone, this is Jams back with a brand new LP. People have requested this one for quite some time, and I finally decided to give it to you guys. The game we're about to play is Sunset Riders, and, in, and if you've ever played Contra, this is basically a spaghetti western equivalent. It is, without a doubt, a very fun game, but very, very challenging. So without further ado, let's get into it. I'm a big fan of Tuco from The Good, The Bad, and The Ugly, so we're going to play as Cormano here because he looks like it. Kind of looks like that character. I've sort of been playing this a couple of times, sort of make, make test runs just to see if I could do it. Yeah, I've only been able to get past the first level once, but we'll just see what happens. Also, another reason why I wanted to LP this is because it's got one of the best lines of video game dialogue in the history of the planet. So, if you're wondering what that is, continue watching. There's our first target, Simon Greedwell, the bastard. He has killed me so many times throughout this. And for the record, we're playing the Super Nintendo version. It's also available on Sega Genesis. And it was also an arcade game. Got a kiss from the lovely lady. Come out. There we go. Get wrecked. Oh, that was close. Oh! 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 Yeah! Whoop! We'll just get up here and you'll see why here in just a minute. It's the running of the bulls. Even though this is clearly the American Southwest. What are pine trees doing in the American Southwest? If anybody that lives in the Southwest is watching this, leave a comment and tell me why. I don't know for sure if they grow there or not. Whoa, what was with that lag? Just crouch. Dodge. I'll just let that one explode. This game has the weirdest instances of slowdown for reasons I can't explain. Maybe... Maybe it's because it's such a good port, I don't know. My best advice for this is don't stop shooting for anything. Unless there are no enemies on the screen. After a while you sort of anticipate where they're going to be coming from though, so don't worry about it too much. Up we go. I lost so many men trying to figure out the pattern of those bulls, let me tell you. Okay, we're at our first boss battle. It's time to pay. Get wrecked! You can do a dash move. Best move in the game by far. When it decides to work. Oh, I just wandered right into that. I am sorry. Jump. That works. Oh! Damn. Now we just fill him full of lead. If we can avoid getting wrecked like that, damn. It's entirely my fault I let myself get cornered. 
Got to learn how to avoid that. That was quite unexpected, but I'm not even complaining. And we'll let the bulls come by. You can also run on those, but why risk it? When you can just come up here and kick back and relax and polish your guns. Backgrounds are a little bit disappointing, but that's okay. These graphics are overall pretty freaking good, I think. Here they come. Jump. Here we go. Oh, that was close. Oh, I almost wandered right into that. Duck. Jump. There's one down. Slide. Slide again. Hey, we actually might get him this time. Here it is, guys. Murray man with my money. Yeah! Knew you guys would like that. Oh, yeah! And we got a one up. All right. Hawkeye Hank Hatfield. Wonder if he sells propane. Okay, we're on a horse now. There's a nice variety of stages in this game too, I think. The trick is to... Okay. That was a thing that happened. Damn! How are you supposed to avoid those? They go by too quick. What happened? I'm sort of on rails here and dead. Hmm.
Like, how am I supposed to dodge that? I can barely see the bullets. There was nothing I could do there, either. This stage is bullshit. What the fuck? Alright, we'll cut it here for now, in case we get game over. Anyway, thanks for watching, take care, and I'll see you next time.